Good Monday morning to you. Happy Monday it is, yes, again, Monday, August 14th, and I hope that you had a pleasant weekend. Whether you were out enjoying some nice weather or inside on a rainy day, perhaps doing some decluttering, I hope it was pleasant and I hope that you're energized for this week. If you're not today, then you will be by tomorrow. Trust me on this. Who am I? I am Kitty Andrews with DeclutterTheBrain.com. Proud to be your thought organizer. What do I do? I help six-figure entrepreneurs to uh, declutter their space and their brains so that they can focus their mental energy on being profitably productive. And it doesn't have to be profit as far as money goes, although that's always handy, isn't it? Yes. So uh, a quick shout out to my viewer All Stars last week who viewed through the newsletter. We have many more on YouTube, but uh, today we want to shout out again, just from the newsletter, uh, Susan, uh, my clients, Susan, Sarah, Heidi, Michael, and then we have Leslie, Susie, and Jean-Claude in India. Mm, hello, hello. Uh, so this week we are talking about declutter for back to school. And that, uh, I didn't plan it this way, believe it or not, but we are launching, or we have launched already, uh, our brand new From Clutter to College your 30 day quick start. So uh, stay tuned on my social and in the newsletter for details on this. Christina, uh, hey Everett, and I have banded together and we are offering a really exciting once in a, a one of a kind program designed to help you and your child navigate into the school year and beyond uh, d get your learning area decluttered and uh, set up some good home schooling as well. Even if the child is going to school, they still have to do homework, right? All right, so let's, again, let's jump into the, this week's content. Declutter for back to school. Now there are two, you may be going, oh no, I can't take it. I don't want to think about this. Um, but there are, two, there are two schools of thought on this. You can either uh, barrel through, get everything done now, everything that you need to do to get you, you, your child, or if you're going back to college maybe, uh, get ready for school, get all of the paraphernalia together, get decluttered, all of this nice stuff, or you can procrastinate to Labor Day. Now, the advantage to starting early, yeah, I know, you wanna be out, um, playing with beach balls. But if you start early, there's a better selection of all of your supplies right now. Uh, I'll explain more about that in a minute. The stores are less crowded now than they will be before, just before Labor Day or whenever school is starting in your area. And you can relax knowing that it's done and you can enjoy the next couple of weeks. Um, also, it teaches your children to be prepared and organized rather than being last minute mollies, which we're all guilty of. Well, a lot of the population is. So it, to, I'll tell you, yeah, I have, I have seen it both ways. I have seen Walmart with, oh, all kinds of clothing and school supplies and, and all of this round about now, mid-August. And then I have seen it two days just before school starts, round about Labor Day in my area. And this, certainly the school supplies, the shelves were decimated. They were half empty, pretty actually, three quarters empty, you you would be hard pressed to find magic markers or pens. It, it was really surprising because I don't live in a big metropolis, but anywho, um, I wouldn't have wanted to be the person who was shopping for their child. And oh yeah, <laughs> lunch boxes? I happened to be looking for a food container for travel and <laughs> 
I, I, I would have felt sorry for, for anyone shopping for that. I was lucky. I found one of the last ones that were for adults, but unless you want your child going to school with a, uh, what is it, frozen ocean, uh, or mermaid or some sort of Disney character on their lunchbox, I suggest that you start early. Yeah. All right, till tomorrow when we talk about what to wear. Have a great day, everybody. Oh, and the glasses, my contacts and I are having a bit of an argument, so I thought I'd try a new look this week. Take care. Bye for now. Clicker doesn't want to work. Okay, old-fashioned way.